guys. Hope you enjoyed that uh, little trailer I made there. Kind of helps make uh, from uh, in these videos a little more fun to uh, add a little bit of, uh, you know, just um, creativity. Everybody's been doing it, so that I jump on. Um, my name is... My name is Jeff. JK, my name's not Jeff. But um, anyways, it's Noah. Anyways. I'm going to stop being around the bush and get to the meat of the video. We were asked to uh, talk about something that we're passionate about or something we thought was interesting in class. And I remember talking in class one day about, you know, reality and the difference between reality and what we want to be reality. And in general, I'd say I'm a pretty controlling person. Instant gratification and um, and getting stuff done has always been a really good feeling for me. Uh, whether it was how I was raised or just how I am or how I was born, uh, it's always been inst getting instant gratification in this technological age. You know, if you want a piece of information, you go look it up on Wikipedia. You used to have to be patient if you wanted to know something. You have to go to the library, wait, you know, wait for your parents to drop you off. Now you could just type it in. Uh, so, relating it back, the idea of reality and what's really happening in the present has always been a little bit scary to me. It's always been something I couldn't change. I'd have to wait to change what's right in front of me uh, in a current moment. And that's something that frustrates me to this day at times. Um, whether if it's how I'm playing a tennis match or how I'm talking to somebody or just um, if I want to change something about myself or other people, I can't in the current moment. And the truth is something that could hurt people. The truth is something that could hurt you. And looking at what's in front of you could be considered illegal in some places. I know last class we were talking uh, a lot about um, a, a lot about how uh, the teaching of a push um, in Al Al Louisiana uh, was kind of outlawed because there's some parts of reality in the in our in America's past that Al or sorry Louisiana uh, wasn't comfortable addressing, and that sort of leads me back to my point is that from class has made me realize more and more that change is gradual. You can't flip switch in the moment and have everything go the way you want it to, and you know I know that. Parts of me knew that before this class. And not to make a blanket statement, but I think a lot of people have something they don't like about themselves or someone else, but the key to changing it is accepting that you can't do anything about it in the moment. Moving on, letting it go, and eventually working hard to uh, control things. That sounded wrong. But working hard to uh, better yourself, or a friend, or still sounds wrong, but you know, thank you.